This is Talib and this is how you become a Muslim, the Shahada. Today I would like to uh, engage the thinkers out there, the people that have uh, spent a lot of time and a lot of money studying and educating themselves. This is something brilliant, something that everybody should do their best to aspire to. For all of that study and all that time that you spent, which has been fantastic, why don't you think about one little thing for the doubters out there, those that think that, you know, this world came together all by itself, it sustains itself all by itself, there's no organizing, there's no structure to it at all. Why don't we just look at the nerve cell? All of us will agree that we have a central nervous system and a peripheral nervous system, things that function and that receive messages so we can do this and we can do that and all these kind of things. It doesn't happen by itself. The nerve cell in and of itself is something that's amazing. It receives messages via a receptor. Like my hands, yeah, I'm receiving messages right now saying it's cold. So I should do this. That's gone to the central nervous system. All that's happened within what, how, how long? A couple seconds, half a second, a millionth of a second. And it continually happens. And I don't tell it to do it. It happens by itself. But for that to happen, there has to be a type of organization. There's got to be a structure to that. And for, for a structure to be able to come together and to maintain itself, something has to have put it together. There has to be a design. There has to be a reason. Therefore, that's why I say that there is no God worthy, worthy of worship except Allah. Now, who's Allah? Allah is not the Muslim God. He's not the Arab God, he's not the Pakistani God, he's the God of all the worlds. All of the prophets and messengers that have come before from Abraham to Solomon to David to the last prophet Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him, have all said, worship one God and don't make partners. They all said the same thing, they all said the same message. So now I'm saying to you, why are you now thinking that God doesn't exist when you would admit and you will even testify, you will say, yeah, I know that the cell exists. I know what the nerve cell does, and I believe in that. And I'll even write a book about it. I know there's some of you that even wrote a book about it. You've even wrote a thesis about it. You did your dissertation on the nerve system or something to do with that. You did that. But then you're not going to say that, well, you know, there's no God really. Or, you know, well, why should I listen to God? Like, why are you haggling? Why are you haggling? Like, you breathe, but you don't tell your brain on, so, okay, brain, tell the lungs to breathe in and take out the carbon. You don't do that. You ain't in control of that. But then you don't want to say, you don't want to admit that there's something that's in control of you. Do you know what that is? That's arrogance. It's arrogance. And you know what? It doesn't suit you. It don't suit you. Like, you are not an arrogant person. You're a humble person. You're a calm person. Okay. Next thing I want to do for the readers out there. You know, like they say, there's, there's, there's like a list, like 50 films. What's 50 films before you die? Like, read 50 books before you die. We got, we, we got books like, you know, like, like a 1984, yeah, uh, 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 Freedom Next Time. And most of you probably read those books. How many of you have read the Quran? The book, which in and of itself proves itself. I don't need to defend the Quran. The Quran does its own job by itself. So, you can get this book now for free. You can get it for free, you don't even have to pay for it. Everyone's looking for something that they don't have to pay for. You can go and get a Quran for free. And in there, there's books, there is, uh, there is proofs, and there's miracles, and there's history, and there's warnings, and there's advice. So, think about how this world came together. Think about if this world came together by randomness, by just a set of gases all coming together and all deciding on one day, well, let's all get together 
let's all come together now and uh you know we'll let's make some mountains okay after we've done that let's 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 like make some grass okay after we've done that let's like uh let's like make some oceans let's make some rivers okay after we've done that let's make some animals but how did it come together like okay so so if you're saying that that allah didn't put it together you say if you're saying that god didn't put it together so who did like who did like like everyone saying well you know god didn't do so and god didn't do and there's no proof so so where so where's your proof then where's your proof like you're saying that allah didn't do it so where's the proof to say that he didn't do it then like where is it you haven't got any have you you ain't got no proof that's okay though that's okay because 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 that's why i'm here yeah i'm here yeah to to say to you yeah, look into islam yeah look into islam it's the truth it's the upgrade in your life blatantly it's the upgrade it's exactly what you've been looking for yeah for those that are sitting on the fence still not sure yeah the, the fact that, you, that you're watching this video that like you're all, all, already taking a step towards it you don't have to worry about like you've been a bad person you've done loads of bad things as soon as you say that shahada i shut up allah ilaha illallah i shut up muhammad rasulullah Everything that you've done before is wiped out. Like you got a clean slate. Between you and God, yeah, it's a clean slate. So think about it, consider. Yeah? Ashadu wa la ilaha illallah. Ashadu wa la ilaha illallah. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum. Assalamu This product is brought to you by. Oh yeah, oh yeah. London Dawa. Dawa. The mood is about to change.